Hello everybody, just thought I'd make a video today about uh, some of the rocks that I found while I was out rock hounding on the southwestern shores of Lake Michigan today. found some pretty neat ones I'd like to share with you. I found some beach worn geodes, some little agates and jaspers and such, some fossilized coral. And uh, oh by the way, my rock tumbler is going in the background in case you're wondering what that weird droning sound is. And uh, I'd also like to share with you some of my more and more favorite rocks. I keep them in a two and a half gallon bucket and uh, in a future video I'd like to share those with you and perhaps you can see why they're my favorites and uh, real quick I'll show them to you and also show you the ones that I found today Hopefully the lighting in here does these rocks justice. Pretty cool black and red rock. You can see these beach worn geodes, how the constantly rolling around in the sand and rocks and such on the beach eventually wears away at this this outer layer and see the quartz and chalcedony on the inside. Got this really cool one that it's almost got a hole going all the way through. But a lot of these pieces of quartz are just tiny remnants of what were geos at one time. A piece of pumice that I found on the beach today. It actually floats in water. Lots the volcanic rocks make their way into the beach there. Probably the first piece of pumice that I actually found though. Some of the fossils that I found today. I can't see in here. But all this right here is all fossilized. This one's really, really cool. Piece of agate, and black and gray and white. This one's definitely going into my favorite bucket.
not really sure what this is, but it's black and it's got this white bands there. It's just got all these faint speckles of gold in there. I'm sure it's not gold, but it just glistens in the sunlight. Really cool. Lots of this yellow jasper out there. Some of it has a reddish tinge to it. These are pretty common out there, they're fossils. This one's got a pretty neat little rounded shape to it. So I thought I'd take this one back home with me. Piece of quartz, real bumpy. You can see some banding in this one. This one's going to be pretty neat when I polish it up. Some of that yellow jasper. Get a cool little greenish tint to it. Found some neat little banded shirt today. Don't normally bring that home with me, but I thought a couple of them look pretty neat, so I had a neat little red dot in it. But the patterns in this one too is going to be pretty cool after I tumble it. This one's like a lavender colored purple rock. I have no idea what that is. But i got this super tiny piece of agate here. It's got these real tight itty bitty bands going through it 
goes all the way around. This is a, the second one of these kind of that I found. So, a little tiny rod. Then I'll sort all these rocks into different different little buckets, little Tupperware buckets that I got. And so I make sure when I tumble them I have mostly the same kind of rocks with the same type of hardness and Fossilized piece of favicite, honeycomb coral. All right in here. It's really cool. And lastly, I got this little guy. See if you can see the. It's red and it's got these little grayish green speckles on it. A nice rounded rock. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video I made sharing the rocks with you today. And uh, I look forward to posting a video shortly about the rocks that I have in my little bucket over here. They're all my favorites. And uh, I hope you have a great night. Thanks again for watching. Take care. Bye.